Archbishop Dominic Lumon, I hope he's still in the compound. <laughs> Father Solomon, Chancellor. Father CJ <coughs> Sebastian. Father Kang, <coughs> Kang Batalum William. His parents, Kang Ba Raphael. Rafunga Mary. T.P. James. Dear fathers, sisters, dear catechists, leaders and dear people of Maram Kulen and the Maram Parish at large. In the first place, I stand here in the name of Dimapur province. Father Provincial being uh, treated for his uh, teeth and all that in Kerala, he could not be here. So I stand in the name of the province and I would like to acknowledge what has been happening here. In the first place, I thank His Grace Archbishop Dominic Lumar for taking the trouble of coming here and ordaining our dear father William. I attended last week an ordination in Kapum and we could understand now how he has to calculate his time, how he has to get up early and come and go and ordain. Uh, so it has been happening like this, and I know it is a great trouble. He has gone early because he has to reach back to his place, and he has to go uh, to, to go for some other programs later. So I thank him profusely for what he has done to our uh, Father William. He has ordained him and made him a new priest. I thank Father Solomon, Chancellor, for following up the candidate, William. He has come one day early to make sure that he's in loco. <laughs> and went through the ceremony 
and all that. Now it is something very wonderful to see, see him going around. Of course, this time he did not give me practice, but last time in Kapum he gave me practice. <laughs> now since that practice is the same as today, so and I managed to go through. I really thank Father for following up our deacons and helping them to go through the ceremony effectively. I thank Father Sebastian, the parish priest, for following up the whole thing. Uh, now, parish priest definitely stands for his people, and therefore, whatever happens there, actually ultimately credit or discredit goes to him. I thank him for all the organization and following up this ceremony today. Then, Father T.P. James was here. We have seen him standing here and giving the running commentary. Now, it is very, very effective. This helps us to understand what this ceremony is. And he has done his part, and we have gone through the ordination very, very smoothly. <clears throat> then I would like to go straight to Father uh, Kangba Talung William. From the time I became the formator and he was a brother, uh, now we have been very, very close. We have been now a different meeting at different places. Uh, and I could see that he was growing, growing. Nobody is perfect. As he himself said, his parents are not perfect. <laughs> Neither are we perfect. Neither the brothers are perfect, those who are getting ordained are perfect. Uh, yeah, but we have seen a brother, uh, as a brother, Rana, growing up and going from perfection to perfection. And today he is just ready to be ordained, he is ordained today. And therefore, we would like to congratulate him for the effort he made in order to make himself uh, to become a worthy priest. Uh, wonderful advice uh, uh, His Grace has given and uh, we really wish him that he will be able to become a good priest and uh, to serve the church at large and also a family in a very special way and to work for the youth in general. And so we pray for him and as we congratulate him. Then I would like to uh, say a few words about for the parents. Uh, his father, Kangba Raphael, and mother, Rapunga Mary. I remember after my ordination, my mother advised me, today you are not only for our family, you are for the whole village and all the people in the world. I was surprised. My mother was not educated, but I understood what it meant. Theology alone does not enlighten us, but when some advice comes from Mary, we are not our own parents, and people who know us, then that makes a great sense. We had one problem with one family, uh, means uh, one man had killed my elder brother, and my mother gave me another advice. She said, you must make uh, a special effort to go to that family. You must not leave that family, you must go to that family and pray there also. I did, and you now I, I can feel, you now as a priest, uh, what we are. So I'm sure uh, Father William will also feel the same and his parents might have given him many advice. I would uh, 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 ask him to follow those advices that he has received from them. But what Father, what uh, his grace has told actually was not only feeding for him but feeding for all our priests and religious here uh, to work uh, to be to, for the church to be ded dedicated uh, to Jesus Christ. Then <clears throat> I would like just uh, so I, I would like to congratulate them, both Raphael and Rapunga Mary, uh, uh, for donating uh, their child to the church first of all, because it belongs to the uh, to, to, he, he has become a <clears throat> servant to the church. And for that, he, he has to uh, go everywhere, as His Grace said, to all the people. You are no more to belong to one family, to one community, but you belong to, to all. Uh, but so they have, I'm sure they, with the understanding, they have sent uh, their uh, son to become a priest. We could say, see the parents 
I mean, breaking down as they were uh, investing, you now removing the you know, symbolic things from his body. I'm sure that at that time it was very, very much choking to them that they were getting, uh, they, they were sending the child to, to the world and that he did not belong only to them but belong to the whole world and to the whole church and in that way they have sacrificed and therefore I would like to congratulate them and thank them for giving the son to the church and to the, uh, to the, uh, to the solution uh, uh, society. Dear friends, uh, we, are, we were shocked to hear the news about the death of Father Matthew Tharakan. Uh, I'm cutting short that part, I think that's enough, but uh, uh, I would just uh, like to uh, bring to our notice to all of us, Father Matthew Tharakan has been working in this uh, in Northeast India and most of his years were spent in Tamil Long and uh, in Mao. And so we can say he has spent his time, uh, actually entire life, in uh, Manipur. He just passed away at 5 o'clock this morning. We are all of us shocked and uh, we would like to, I would just uh, give you the program in case uh, some of you are able to go and pay homage to him. Uh, to his body uh, tomorrow in Mao. So the, this is the program that we have made for the province and uh, uh, those who are able to go can, uh, can go there. <clears throat> the mortal remains of Father Tarakan Matthew SDB will be brought to Mao Manipur via Dimapur but we will not uh, spend much time there tonight and kept in Mary help of Christians parish Punanamai Mao Manipur. That is tomorrow. Body will come tonight. Uh, so maybe early morning we pass uh, through Dimapur and, uh, and uh, the, the body will remain the whole day there. And uh, following morning, early morning around 3, 4 o'clock, the body will be taken down to uh, Dimapur for the final rite.
Felicitation address. Felicitation address and Niki Reverend Father Nazarius Lakra S D B B Vice Provincial Nima Purdado and Dam Dam Puglo Tule. Council. The Vice President, the Vice President, St. John Bosco, Parisma, the Vice President, Vice President, St. John Bosco, Paris, Secretary, the Papu St. John Bosco, Parisma, Secretary, and the Epicito, President St. John Bosco, Paris Women Association, President St. John Bosco, Paris Women Association. I do because the President Saint John Bosco Paris Youth Organization Youth Ma this uh, Paris Ma Youth Ma President of Papua Shilo gift for to be followed by Catechist Maram Kulen Saint Peter Church to be followed by Catechist Maram Kulen Saint Peter Church Saint Peter Sir Hiba Felix Nana. I think I give the chicken except to say hello. To be followed by convener, ordination committee, Sir Muntuba Francis. Sir Muntuba Francis. Next to be followed by co convener, ordination committee, Sir Tuba Mansfield. Tuba Samuel Mansfield. And I request all the church committee members to please come in front and accept a small token of gift from uh, Reverend Father Kangwa Talung William. Church committee na alusa sa pa gift accept us elok tigna. Church committee maklaiga adui patselo. Committee Mle Saint Peter Church, Marum Kulema. Church Committee Ma, Ayle Church Committee, the Governor Nugu Pangjen Sai Tung Sun Tuna Ma Ordination Tom Tamki. Ay Committee Sat 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 Sale Umba. Nama Queer Director Sir Michael. Queer Director Makiama. Makama Queer Director Tole Stasi Ken Nama Tengne Ma Ko. Queer Director Tolan Pona to cover Church of Pangjang Sai to Zambad Musasa. Sir Michael, Queer Director, Alung Susa, now Deepa Silo. Sir Michael will come and stand in the middle of the committee. Father, Please, uh, Father, please give this, uh, these things and then Sir Michael will join. He will be in the middle with you. <laughs> Sir, the uh, Mausan and Paris priest, they are already here, so I request our catechist and then our Paris priest to please come over the dice and accept a small token of gift from the, yes, Paris priest and then our catechist to accept a small token of gift from our family and then from our church. Thank you. Paris priest and then our catechist. Paris, Paris. Thank you so much, Father. And our vibrant and enthusiastic uh, catechist, Sir Himba Felix. 
to be followed by President Makia. President Makia. Thank you, St. Peter Church Women President. St. Peter Church Women President. St. Peter Church Ma Women President, except Gift Kitchen, except the Salo. In the full blame on the Lusa Salo. Sana give except uh, Katina Pusello. In a fumba salubula, a night cooler, a night pundilla, a pupundilla, a pukinger, a pukanger, a pukina, a pau ram, a pau talu, a paira and a punama, a pai rapuma kulakpa, a pai puna maramaza, a paikin, a paikana maram center, popsin and maram center. A paisaka punama, a fongonetrope disipunama, a pairapunga sugumbam, a pumbula maram center, a for Rafael Sio Mon, a pokam balero, a sir, a for Kamba, a collective member collective, a Narso, a for Suiba, Colonel, a for Kreka of Punama, a Naikulam Gaima, a pokam balero. A pui 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 ne pui krai langomai a fo talungomai a pai kusunga grace pui krai lalero ina fo kusai mata alusa satnam. Presentation Taya and the choreography like the Tayuna Christian Revival Church, Maram Kulan Unina Kamgido and Data Sakusai Lotoki request us like Nama presentation tu, nona nana presentation kesai ki PH ngono marilus nana presentation kesai azai ke form pamai. Pui tengga semua lain sana apotah nama ke stage tay announcing burki pasal nama nama presentation tu pui selalu tu kita mesti selalu. Lalu pui sa kemti nuno azai form pata sa nama pot pui tengga semua. Aki unen na gunat sila lina, aki stage tay patsa unen ma potter pui pui silo sa aki datam patsa lile.
Nelayan kui sekamati, spemai kata, spemai kata, guna mana zainul nafom patsa, udah na pot pun tengah sulailina, along sesa, stay stay lah sesa, udah mana pot pun saya log tu mesti sulaila. Nelayan kui sekamati, spemai kata, spemai kata, guna mana zainul nafom patsa, udah na pot kita pun tengah sulailina, stay school lah sesa, udah mana pot pun pun saya log setam sulaila. My presentation are Louis of Namal choreography. Choreography like thing like Christian Revel Church, Maram Clan. They do the words from Maram Priest. Present, I may request all our uh, member present here to just give a clap for all the people standing here. Thank you, MC, for giving me this privilege. Uh, as I call out the name, I request the uh, uh, concerned per person to please come, uh, kindly come on the dikes and accept this gift from the Father Kangba Talung William and uh, our family plus uh, our church and then the Maka member as a whole. I request Father Kangba Talung William to please come on the dikes and then to hand over this gift. Uh, first, I may I call upon uh, Reverend Father Nazarus Lakra has to be the vice provincial of the Mapro province. Father, please kindly accept this as a small token of gift from our family. <laughs> the next, I request uh, Father CJ Sebastian as to be the parish priest of St. John Bosco Parish Maram. To please kindly accept a small token of gift from our family and from our church and from the community as well. Most respected, your lordship, right Reverend Dominic Lomon. The Archbishop of Ifal, Reverend Father Nazario Lakra, the Salishan Vice Provincial of Dimapur Province, Reverend Father Solomon, the Chancellor of the Ifal Archdiocese, fathers, sisters, brothers, and dignitaries. Niki Anungsi Uzan Jokber Francis, former Minister of Manipur, Maram Union President Sir Rai Sung, Maram Union President Maidam Ka Rizina, MKS President Sir Kasung Bosco, Makwa President Maidam P. Gina Lucy, Maka President Sir Puba James, Makia President Sir Hiruba, MTU President Sir John, YSDWA President Maidam Hana, YSDCO Weigo President Monica and her team. Yes, DCU President Sir Afonso Daniels. Paris Youth Saint John Bosco Paris Duibiba and his team. Catechists, pastors, 
learn from different villages. NMPO chairman Uza Kraihing, NMWO president Ms. Madam Jenny, NMS WO president Sir P. Kriber Francis, XADC -S -S Sir Erat, Sir Enzikandira, Sir Arpuba, Sir Tuba Angelus, Sir Liba Thomas. Special invitees, our village headman Apo Kanamba, village authorities, faithful and well wishers. Priesthood is God's greatest, greatest gift to the family. On this gracious and happy occasion, I, on behalf of the St. Peter Church Maram Kulen, would like to extend my heartiest words of welcome to each of you present here to this short felicitation program. Your kind presence has invoked God's immense blessings upon our newly ordained priests of God in particular, and the people of Maram in general. Your presence has added much joy, color, and meaning to our celebration. Thank you for solemnizing this occasion with your encouraging and presence and prayers. Please do enjoy the program. Prepare with love in honor of our newly ordained priest, Reverend Father Kamba Talung William SDB. Once again, I wish you a hearty welcome and may God bless you. Thank you. If the Lord does not build a house, in vain do its builders labor. If the Lord does not watch over the city, in vain does it, is its watchmen keep vigil. The Lord pours gifts on his beloved while they slumber, reads Psalms 127. Hands on my chest, I humbly acknowledge that the story of my family, which is also the story of my life, has been nothing short of a series of miracles. From the very humble start, God has always been the one steering and piloting our way to where we are here and now. The providence and bounteous love of God has always stayed true to us. The rather clement weather we are enjoying now is a standing testimony. Hope all of you will vouch for the same. God has come alive through the many generous people of goodwill who have put their hands, hearts and heads together to contribute in cash and kind, prayers and blessings towards the realization of this day. I am immensely gra grateful to His Grace most Reverend Dominic, Do Dominic Luman, Didi, for the time we met December last and also during the first week of June, you have been courteous and you did consent to come in person to lay your hands on me and confer the order of presbytery to me, an unworthy servant. To the Salesian congregation, particularly the Salesian province of Dimapur, Father Provincial who couldn't be here, Father Vice Provincial whose simplicity and affability captivates me, Father Benny James, the economer who has been to me much more a friend than a father. Present and past provincial councillors, former provincials, former vice provincials, my former rectors, former parish priests, Father Sebastian Menenchira who took pains to reach Maram for the occasion, Father N.J. Syriac, Father M.D. Vergis, Father Kindo Joseph, particularly Father K.S. Joseph who has been so gracious to host me on particular occasion on multiple occasions and sponsoring the chasuble and cassock for my use today. To all my Salesian conferers and the young people, especially the poor, I owe my life to you. If today I am a priest of God, it is for you. To all my superiors, teachers, elders, friends, those younger to me, to all of you who have formed and groomed me, I'm not here claiming I'm a finished good. But like Father T.P. James would say, God is still working on me. Yes, to all who have helped and allowed me to see the light of this day, I am grateful to you. My parish priest, Father C.J. Sebastian S.D.B., deserves a special mention. He has toiled really, really hard, synergizing the efforts and contributions of the parishioners, associations and the members of St. Peter's Church, Maramkulen. He effectively collaborated with all to make this day a resounding success. Thank you, Father Joseph Pampigal, SDB, Director of DBHSS 
Madam and the Conference, Father Xavier Matam, Brother Benerus, and Father Elo Lawrence for allowing me to make your community and extended family a second home to me. Father Pampigal has in fact gifted me the chalice for the ordination. When it comes to conveyance and stay, Don Bosco Higher Secondary School Maram community has always been much more than kind. I also thank the community of Don Bosco College for making available the resources and the things they have for today. My heart, my heart goes out in gratitude to Reverend Father T.P. James for ably emceeing today's ceremony. I also thank Father Rang and Father Hingba for guiding me and helping me all this while. I'm grateful to you, dear Father Samuel Dilbung, the secretary to the Archbishop, for facilitating and waiting a way out to schedule my meeting His Grace very comfortable and easy. Thank you, Father Solomon Thesa, the Chancellor, for helping us in the flow of the ceremony. You dared to bear the biting cold of Maram Kulen for my sake. My spiritual directors have rendered me a yeoman's service. I make a joyful mention of Father Tinglung, Father Kamil, Father Veer Thomas, Father M.P. Thomas, Father Tom Kartik, who is here, Father Jos Kutiani Matatil, and my present spiritual director, Father Bosco Pontokan. I am forever grateful, dear spiritual fathers, for hearing me out, for your listening ear and understanding heart. Philippians 1, verses 3 and 4 reads, I thank my God each time I think of you and every time I pray for you, I pray with joy. This is really true when it comes to my family. My eyes well up with tears of joy and my heart brings with joy again. The thought of my family brings to me, you have been with me through thick and thin. Mom and dad, you are not perfect, but you are to me, you are to us, a perfect pair of human couple, perfect parents. The sleepless nights, the days, months and years of toil perhaps are bearing fruit in some sense today. I pray that I am a source of God's blessings and also a source of strength from now on. Buina, Dingna, sorry, Buina, Jingpu, Dingna, Naba, and Lungsila, my siblings, I can't ask for more. We form the God willed and God destined set of siblings, rubbing each other's shoulders and nagging our way out in our own peculiar and unique way. We now thank you for playing the second fiddle in many ways, more than one. Your altruism is, is matchless. You keep all of us in good cheer. Love you, big bro. Chingpu, you, you are that brother keeping us at ease, often at your own expense. I love you. Dingna, the unseen sweat and tears you shed sets you apart from many others. Keep trusting God. Naba, you are enterprising. Keep eking the best from yourself. Thank you. Lungsila, my baby sister. Behind the scene, you keep slogging. I love you, darling sister. To all my uncles, aunties, cousins, nephews, and nieces who have contributed me beyond measure and calculations, my prayers are with you always. I'm thanking God, and I'll keep thanking God for all of you. I articulate my deep sense of gratitude to Maka under Maramaria Catholic Association, under the able leadership of Sir Puba James, who is himself my uncle, you have gone an extra mile to make this day so special to me. The president of Makwa, Madam P. Kina Lucy and team, incidentally, she is my aunt. I spent a memorable and an informative year with her. Sir Hingruba and team, Makia, SDCU president of Cellophones for opening our doors and windows, all the more spreading our horizons and representatives from SDCYO and catechists of different villages. A sincere word of thanks to VSDB sisters, sisters from the Madonna and Pum, who meticulously saw to the liturgical arrangements and floral embellishments to make this day as colorful and beautiful as it could be. In this regard, I acknowledge the support and help and the help of the sisters from the SMMI, FMI, FMA sisters, both from the college and higher, higher secondary community, and FCC sisters from SSC convent. They rose to the occasion to impress us with their teamwork and God-gifted talents, decorating late into the night in spite of the chilling cold. I place on record the kindness and generosity of Sir Robert and family, Angamis from Zubza, who have contributed not just a part, but the whole of the fresh 
and gorgeous flowers with all the varieties, liliums, birth of paradise, roses in different colors, Christmas plants and much more. I will ever stay indebted to you. My heart reaches out in thankfulness to our catechist, Sir Himba Felix, who by the way was also my school teacher, my teacher at school. You took a very keen interest to make this day a red letter day. I am moved to tears when I saw the conveners of the ordination, Sir Nguntupa Francis and Sir Tuber Samuel Mansfield, running from, the, running from pillar to post, slogging days, weeks, months on end. I can't put into words my sentiments. Thank you so very much. The altar service today did a commendable job. Thank you. I also thank, thank the four MGR, Brigadier Sir and his contingent, Assam Rifles, 22 Assam Rifles and also the 33 Assam Rifles for making available the things they have for the use of today's ceremony. You can't get any better, Oja Michael, the Makkah music director. Feels like you are in your teens. Sweet 16, they say. Seems like you are evergreen. Thank you and thank you, sir, for carrying this day on your shoulder. I also thank Sir R.K. Samuel for the design and the flex printing. Sir Dui Viba Peter, my classmate and the younger brother of Brother John Gowning for the layout and the print of the leaflet. In this August assembly, I am privileged to acknowledge the presence of the Maram Chief, Apo Namba, the President of Maram Union, Uncle Rising and his colleagues, Maram Thangal Union President, Sir A. John and his colleagues, Executive Secretary of the MRNBA, Reverend Kaba and his associate secretaries, Baptists and revival pastors and deacons of churches in and around Maram. Sir Bosco T. Kasung, the president of MKS Maraluk Rilime Sujikang, Madam Kanga Regina and her colleagues from the Maram U Women Union, ma'am, who is my mummy's younger sister, of the many things she did, she was instrumental in procuring the gifts for the guests. The NMPO, NMWO presidents and ex executives, former MLAs and minister, public leaders, elders, and village authorities. St. Peter's Church Kito, a pure photo circulate church committee, my hung, Hamazutle, Gonene, Pimtaitose, Nlain Lung Hasaise, Smaller Tosaitle, Hol Klilampato, Knitratose, Amalan Saise, Angang, Angasi Batosaise, Danska Zalampato, a tinkery, a tinker Punglampan, a pot lampanto, a zampet, a gonene, Mutabet, Toka Sagido, Egonego, Mada Udo Mangalale. Saja sesepur lusik leda i guna ma apa urip elak telaga bo. Sias mai, mai hangsing bezai talak do. Kau nego halanzut le, guna ne zaman day mungo saja stays, top stays, bang gudo. Guna mai hinga alat yang susai se, tak gad beting ne umal imek benai alat tu tu sai se tingkat kep se zaman ne. Guna mai hinga gudo, pembena strip se metudeng le saja ini do kisa, kau bukar tal stay. I'm only at the receiving end. So many people. The CRC, such a Christian Revival Church, Maram Glen, such a Baptist, my Pumai Udo, Halantle, Gunima, Alone, Item, Nahonang Odenga, do it yourself. Uzamba Kartato Hai Tosar Tosai to Zamana my Lao Halanle. Thank you, sound engineer. I do not have your name, uh, still then, and your assistance for the professional management of the sound. To all the camera persons, thank you. Special thanks to Brother Favito Elvis SDB for live streaming and giving a coverage to this event, facilitating online viewers and participants. He obliged even when I approached him only at the 11th hour. I count all of you as blessings, dear fathers, sisters, brothers, elders, teachers, friends, well-wishers, and benefactors. You have showed up in great number. I reckon your presence as the abundance of God's bounteous blessings. Coming to a close, 
Just when the caterpillar thought the world has come to an end, it became a butterfly. Like a butterfly, I am on a threshold of a new chapter of my life with the motto, what will it profit a man if he gains the whole world yet loses his soul? And with a banner in front of me, with a banner in front of me, the cross before me, the world behind me. I invoke the most powerful intercession of our Blessed Mother, Saint Joseph, Saint John Bosco, Mother Teresa, Saint Dominic Savio, Saint Philip Neri, Saint Anthony of Padua, Saint Francis of Assisi, Saint Padre Pio and Saint Maria Goretti, and all of you gathered here, that receiving your blessings and by your prayers, I may become a holy priest of God. To all of you who have come to witness, pray, bless, and accompany me on this day, which marks the beginning of my roller coaster ride with Jesus, the love of my life. You have made it from far and near. If my prayerful blessings count for anything, you have them all. May God bless all of you.